triple threat. What a response, as you mentioned about a week ago against Dubuque. You said how resilient this club is. I mean, what was different tonight than last night? Yeah, I think there's a lot of ups and downs in the playoffs in these long series, and we know how we want to play, and we got away from it a little bit last night. I think we saw a little bit more of it tonight, and our goal is just to keep building. How do you guys as a staff stay so cool, calm, and collective? I think we're very focused on how we want to be playing and what we want to be doing, and our guys know their game plan and how to execute, and we're just there to support them. And even when the Steel got in some penalty trouble, they were able to bail their teammates out at certain times. And then the third period, your thoughts on the Steel closing this thing down heading to Youngstown title? Well, yeah, first of all, Matt Deschamps with the penalty kill does a great job. And our I thought our players executed great, and they dug deep. And we got a huge couple kills there. And then, obviously, you need your goalie to be your best penalty killer. And he was excellent tonight. I love the way Christian Manns competed. I love the way he worked. And then as far as closing out a game, it's more just playing steel hockey and going wave after wave. Lastly, Coach, because I know we got to get moving, but Keys as Youngstown now is home ice. I know that doesn't deteriorate your plans, but what do you want to see the steel do from the drop of the puck Monday night? Yeah, I want us to just keep playing steel hockey at our pace and have every guy going and playing to the best of their ability. Thanks, Coach.